Tonight, we're finding out more about the victim, 31 year old Nicole Vanderheiden. NBC 26's Marissa DeCandido spoke with her mother and sister today. She continues our live team coverage. Well, Stacy, her family tells me this has been a nightmare, and they're still searching for answers about what happened to their sister and daughter. She was an absolutely amazing person. Heather Meyer and her family say it doesn't seem real. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. She's been no. extremely up and down, numbing pain. Losing the bright light of a sister and daughter. Her big smile. That shone in their lives. A perfect mother. And the lives of Nicole Vanderheiden's three children. I think it just hasn't hit them yet. The reality that they're never going to see their mom again. Meyer says her sister was a devoted mother. There's our kids playing in the, the sandbox. A sentiment echoed by her close friend. She radiated love and light. Nikki, as her friends and family call her, was also a substitute teacher in the Green Bay School District. Science was her niche. Who loved nature and showing her kids the outdoors. She had a genuine wonderful passion for life. Both friends and family have set up a GoFundMe account and a fund on generosity.com for funeral expenses and her children. It's giving them the life that they deserve and she would have wanted for them. To help ease the hurt. She will always be in our heart. Of this tragic loss. Well, Vander Hyden's three children are being cared for by family, and the family is asking that instead of sending flowers or cards, that you donate on the GoFundMe or Generosity.com sites. Live in Ledgeview, Marissa Candido, NBC 26.